They may have been, but another time I saw him when he was training really heavy, so he could if he wanted to, you know. I saw I saw Flex Wheeler with his little joints and all that, yeah. Don't look strong. But I saw him incline pressing 160 pound dumbbells, got them up on his own, did 10 reps and put them down. It didn't look very difficult. And I was like, fuck that, I'd find that quite hard, you know? And I'm bigger, so, he, you know, he put the work in, but probably not always, you know? I was always. Well, that's interesting. On, on the studies they did for people who had like muscular dystrophies, they would find they increased the muscle mass by giving a myostatin, like it inhibit myostatin, either through antibodies or like siRNAs, which is different mRNA, other techniques to say, hey, Gene, don't make this, or hey, we're going to block the myostatin. There's many different techniques of blocking myostatin. And what they found was it, they all did increase lean muscle mass, decrease body fat, but they didn't, weren't able to walk out of that chair. And so it makes you wonder if it has to be with the, the muscle neuron connection. So the muscles were bigger, but they were not functional? They weren't functional enough to, to fix that dystrophy. 